Hey guys! Today on my channel I'm going to be showing you how to make runes just like they do on the TV show Shadowhunters. Stay tuned! So one of the most popular ways that people tell me they like to put their runes on is with a sharpie. Um, the only thing I don't like about Sharpie is that it's not non-toxic and it's very hard to get off your skin once you're done. So if you have to go to work the next day after a convention or maybe a photo shoot, it's probably not the best option. So I'm going to show you guys how to do runes the way they do on the TV show Shadowhunters. So here's what you're going to need to do these runes. You're going to need some tape, scissors, bowl of water, some prosade, some aqua bamboo makeup sealer, and possibly some isopropyl mirastate. You're also going to need temporary tattoo paper. Um, I got mine from Jordan Cosmetics in Canada, which is the exact source that the Shadowhunter show uses. Um, I just printed out my runes, figured out what sizes I needed for the characters that I was playing, uh, printed them out on a laser printer, has to be a laser printer, and then I prepped these by covering all the black areas with Prazade. And once that's done, you can put your little bit of plastic over top of it and you're ready to apply them. So today, I'm going to show you how to apply them. So what you're going to do is take whatever rune you want to use. I'm using the shapeshifter rune today. And you're just going to cut them out. Okay, the first step to any good temporary tattoo application is going to be clean skin. Make sure that you either shower right before you do this or wash whatever part of your skin you're putting these on because any excess dirt or oil can make the tattoos not stick. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your aqua bamboo spray and you're going to shake it until the little ball inside stops making noise. Sometimes this takes longer than usual. No more shaking. And then what you're going to do is I'm going to put this on the inside of my wrist where Clary's goes. Just spray two sprays on the skin and let that dry before you do anything else. <laughs> okay, once it's dry, you're ready to start applying your tattoos. So what you're going to do is take the little plastic sheet off and you're going to place it right on top of the bamboo spray you've just used. Stick it down really nice and hard. And then you can either take a paper towel or a rag dip it in the water, make sure it's nice and wet, and then you're going to gently sponge over the tattoo until the entire paper is soaked. Pretty much just like you would apply tattoos when you were a little kid and you know you got them at the dentist or a birthday party. Just make sure they're nice and soaked because if they're not completely wet, parts of your tattoo are not going to stick to your skin. and just peel away. Now, once that dries, because it is going to be a little bit damp, you're going to take your aqua bamboo again, and you're just going to do two sprays right over top to seal your tattoo. This is going to make it be a little less sticky and keep it water resistant. So if you're sweating or, you know, if you're doing a little bit of activity with your runes on, you'll be good to go. And you're done. That's it. Simple, easy, and everything is relatively cheap. Um, the supplies for this, um, there's a giant sheet of the tattoo paper, which is about 23 inches by 26 inches, if I recall correctly. It makes about five uh, regular size sheets of runes. Um, the Prosade was probably $12, I want to say, for two ounces, uh, which doesn't seem like a lot, but this will go a long ways. You don't need a lot. Um, the Aqua Bamboo Spray is probably the most expensive thing, but it's probably the most crucial thing. Um, this bottle, I believe, was 20 or 25 bucks. Um, you can definitely check on the website, and I'll have links below um, for all the material you're going to need. Um, and then Isopropyl Mirror State was fairly cheap. I think this bottle was only like 6 or $7. Um, and that's only if you have um, really porous skin and you have a hard time getting things off. So now that you have this lovely rune on, I'm going to show you how to take it off. So just take a little bit of packing tape. I have a cool tape gun. Take a piece off, and you're going to lay that tape right over your arm, press down, and then when you rip it away, your tattoo will be right there. 
So you may need to do this one or two times because you'll notice there's a tiny bit left on my arm. Um, but it does all come off really easily. And if there's anything left that you don't want to take off with tape, just go ahead and use your isopropyl Miristate, rub it on there with a paper towel, and it'll come right off. So that's all there is to it. Simple, easy, and definitely worth it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, let me know below and hit the little subscribe button on the little end screen that's coming your way. Thanks guys. Bye.